what are some of the things you look out for when you see someone that's possibly hurting from abuse but don't know it? What are some of the things you look So just to take a step back for a second to what you said earlier, you know, about there being a lot of fear around the stigma of abuse and trying to eradicate that stigma because it's part of life. Everybody, a lot of people have been exposed to that. And what I found when I came out of the abusive circumstances I was in is when you talk to someone, they're like, and especially if they haven't been through abuse, like you're saying, it's like, well, why didn't you leave? Why did you go back? Why did you? And a victim will take on that and be like, oh, gosh, I'm so embarrassed. I'm shameful. I'm, you know, you take that inward. But I kind of turned that around a little bit. And I used to I went to the local um, domestic violence shelter, picked up some brochures. And if someone said that to me, I would hand them the brochure and kind of educate them a little bit on, well, here's what abuse is all about. So when you tell me, you know, why didn't you leave? Here's why I didn't leave. You know, it doesn't it doesn't just happen like that overnight. It, it's a period of years, days, a month, hours that you're continually in this. Maybe there's ups and downs and all things circling around you um, that you're experiencing good times, bad times, you know, ugly times, as we say sometimes. Mm-hmm. And and to bring all that together and be able to uh, just educate. Uh, and that's part of what we do in norm therapy and, and abuse refuge, especially in our social media. We're educating people on this is what abuse is and have you experienced it before? And, you know, some people haven't. They'll come. I was talking to uh, someone earlier and they, that, they said that, too. They're like, yeah, I went to your website and I read all these things, all these types of abuse you covered. And, geez, I didn't realize I've. I'm being abused. And so it just kind of opens up their eyes and exposes them to that side of healing or that side of growing uh, within themselves. 